Hello and welcome from park number two post lockdown. We're here at a personal favourite park of ours. You could probably guess where it is. It's Alton Towers. We love it, Alton Towers. You can probably guess what it is from the title of this video. Exactly. <laughs> Moon of Guess. It's probably a thumbnail of like a Wicker Man or something. So there you go. We're at Alton Towers Resort. Uh, happy to be back. Honestly, it's uh, it's nice. Yeah. I'm looking forward to this one. Um, so many of uh, you know our favourite rides are here. Mostly excited to get back on Wicker Man. Definitely. Love Wicker Man. I'm actually excited to get back on Nemesis. I'm not a huge overall fan of Nemesis, but for some reason, I, You're I just feeling want, it. I'm feeling it. I'm really feeling it. So <laughs> I'm excited to ride that and see how that is. The Smiler, personal favourite of mine. Can't wait to get back on that one as well. And then we'll see what else we do. You know, who knows? Who knows? But uh, it's always filming with a. Uh, <laughs> Double, double vlog. Double vlog, there you go. I think what we're going to do is head to the Smiler and try and like pre-queue a little bit and then maybe pop on over to the other side. Yeah, because at the entrance they're just letting everybody in. So we literally just walked straight in. There was no queuing at the front. So now we don't know what to do because we're in so early, okay. but we'll see what the Smiler's doing, I guess. Yeah, we'll just wait around, have a look around the Smiler area and uh, yeah, check it out. But. Yeah, excited to be back, hoping that this is a good day. Uh, queues, you know, will probably be relatively busy, but that's okay. on the Smiler and uh, we pre-queued it so we joined the queue at about 22, 10 maybe. Mm -hmm. So then the ride actually started going at about 5 to 10 and we got on at 20 past. So pretty good going. Um, the queue moved constantly. Didn't it did, it? it was very quick actually. Um, there was lots of chevrons which were quite far apart so that was good. Um, but yeah, I'm surprised because I thought it was going to take a while to get on, but then it didn't, so... Yeah, no, in the end, um, it didn't take too long. Everything moved relatively fast, so happy days. And uh, we got back row, which isn't our favourite row. No. <laughs> Prefer the front, honestly, but it was good. It was forceful. I mean, that's the, probably the most intense roller coaster we've been on in a long time. Yeah. Uh, you know, more intense than the kiddie rides at Poulton's Park, so... Um, but yeah, it came off, like, ooh, that's, a, that's what a roller coaster <laughs> that was is, a roller coaster, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so... Anyway, that's ticked off. Now we're moving over to Nemesis and potentially Galactica. Uh, depends what the queues are like, but definitely Nemesis first. Just done Nemesis and Jewel. First Nemesis, it was good to get back on it, man. I've, I've missed it, it's been a long time. Zoe, on the other hand, didn't really care, did you? I think I'm going off it. Like, all it is is the bits of a roller coaster that I hate, and that's like it. So it's just too intense, and I don't like it. We were on the back row, so it was very, very intense. The, the zero G roll that whips over the station, the clearance on that is crazy. Like, you don't really realize that. Back left, mental, lovely. Love the force. You know, we're talking that the Smiler was forceful for a ride, but Nemesis was another notch up from that. So, yeah, really good, really good to be back on it. 15 minute wait for it. Yeah, it was really quick. Didn't take very long to wait for. Um, then we did Jewel. Jewel's reopened recently. Uh, never has a queue, Jewel. So easy, nice, relaxing ride. Love Jewel. You're always a fan, aren't you? I love Jewel, yeah. It's really good. And it was really dark this time. It was. It was like pitch black everywhere. Yeah, which was very strange, very strange. But atmospheric, so, oh well, yeah. Anyway, we were going to go get some pizza, but we don't think the pizza place is open quite yet. So now we're heading over to Wicker Man, uh, our favourite ride here by far. We love Wicker Man. Um, and I think it's on a 60 minute queue or something, which is quite short for Wicker Man. So we'll hop on there grab some pizza and we'll be happy. You excited for pizza? Yes. So we 
just came off of Wicker Man. Big bob right there. Happy to have just ridden it. I forgot how good it was. Um, definitely the best ride here. But yeah, literally I just forgot how good it was. And we were only on row, row three. Three, yeah. We weren't even at the back and it was so good. Yeah, it was really good. It's a good ride to back up. Uh, just as chaotic, just as crazy as it was before. Really hoping that we can go on it again later today and perhaps try and get a back row ride. It was around 12-ish when we got on it. So, you know, I'm hoping that a big, big one, final fast ride at the back, row 12, would be very ideal. But we'll see. But anyway, yeah, it was good to be back on it. Really enjoy Wicker Man. Love just being able to see it in the queue as well. Yeah. It's just a nice one to kind of queue for. And see it all and you get different viewpoints of the ride i don't know it's all good it's all good stuff so we're saying that it, it, it'd be weird towers wouldn't feel the same without it now yeah. you know it's only been here two years but it feels like such an integral part of the park Pizza. The pizza was very good. We thought it was going to be a takeaway, but it was actually the buffet, and they just had um, staff members serving you so you didn't have to pick up anything. So it was really good actually, wasn't it? It was. We've got a cookie as well, a free cookie. So it's a nice cookie, enjoyed that. But then after that, we got the sky ride to just have a, have a nice time going across. So we went all the way to Dark Forest to look at Rita's queue and thought, nah. Um, <laughs> I know we came here. The time said 60 minutes, but it was like 20. So if you're a fan of spin ball, then I think the time is great. Um, so yeah, and honestly, this is one of my favorite rides here. Spin ball? Yeah. I don't know. Wow. Right now, out of all the rides I want to ride, if, if there wasn't any queues, it would be Wicker Man than this. Wow. I just love it. I, I don't know. It was really funny. So they obviously only load your group, so we only had two people, so it was spinning like crazy because it was only half the car full. Yeah. It was really fast. Everyone's spinning like crazy, which just makes it so much better, you know. So, quality ride, but I think now we're going to end the day on a final ride on Wicker Man, a second ride. Hopefully get near the back, but we'll see. That's it, we just had our final ride of the day. Uh, Wicker Man, back row. I very cheekily asked if we could sit back row <laughs> and the woman was okay to do that. So, very happy about that. What do you think, Zoe? It was so good, literally so good. I don't know, it's just so good, isn't it, on the back? It is, it is. Very fast, very fun, very chaotic, forceful. All of that, you know, you get chucked around loads. It's, uh, it's a lot of fun to, to be on, but um, Wicker Man, Great ride to end the day with. Very good to be back at the Old Taz Resort. You know, it's a, a, a favorite park of ours. Um, been on the ride so many times that now it's just nice to kind of relax, take it yeah. easy, which we did today, honestly. We took it a bit more easy than normal, just rode what we, what we could be asked to ride. People are asking about queue times and whether they're accurate or not. We found that they were either accurate or severely underestimate, yeah. overestimated. Even. Overestimated, yeah. So, spin ball, allegedly 60 minute queue, 20 minutes really. Wicker Man, uh, towards the end of the day just now, 70 minute allegedly, and it was 40, 45 minutes. Yeah. You can expect the queue times to be about right or uh, much higher than normal. So, there you go. But mm -hmm. generally social distancing, people are annoying, right? You know, some people are socially distancing and and other people aren't. And I think that's probably everywhere you go, isn't it? Old Towers have tried their best with all the markers on the floor to, to separate people. Yeah. But if people aren't sticking to those rules and they're trying to enforce it by going over the tannoy and you know saying, you know, social distancing is in place, please stand at the chevrons. But 
people don't always listen. So lots of hand sanitizers as well, though. There are um, yeah. signs everywhere, so it was really clear. It's just um, whether people are going to ignore towers or not, basically. But yeah. the majority of people are okay. So we've right. had a good day overall. Um, as I said it's good, good to be back. Good to get on some coasters. Um, but anyway, thank you for watching this one. We'll see you all next time.